On now, Shawnee Mission East High School now asking a tough question. Is the Johnson County School racist? Students doing it in an article in their school newspaper. They're talking about this only on 41 Action News. Lexi Souter talked with the young men and women working to answer that question. Justin, here's a look at the newspaper article published by Shawnee Mission East High School students. And students here say the discussion about race is one that needs to be had. Yeah, the picture of me is captioned like, I want to date you, but my dad said not to date black guys. Shawnee Mission East I mean, senior Ronnell I mean, Lewis is one of several like, African American like, students you know, featured in the school's kind of recent of newspaper like, article titled, know, Is East Racist? <laughs> Lewis says his fellow students are not racist, but believes many lack exposure and education. It's a little different because they come at you with these words and they seem so genuine, so kind. And you're just like, how can these things come under your mouth? And then you step back and realize, well, you aren't really aware with it. You're not used to it. Of more than 1,600 Shawnee Mission East students, 28 are African American. That statistic alone was enough for online editor in chief of the newspaper, Julia Poe, to start a school wide discussion. It is mathematically highly probable that you will go through your entire time at East, if not your entire time in the district, never have a class with a black kid. Poe gathered her material by sitting in on a weekly meeting between East African American students. I mean, when I had someone actually say, I wish I was white, that's, that's awful. In the article, she shares the concerns students like Lewis have, not being asked to school dances, on dates, or the simple jokes about their hair or athletic ability that Lewis admits hurt. It's a joke, everyone laughs, but we're not laughing. Both students say their goal is simple, to create a conversation that in return helps everyone. It's very easy to not be, um, to not have that in your life whatsoever, which is kind of hard in some ways because then you don't know how to act when issues of race come up. High school teacher here, David Muhammad, has been instrumental in helping these students find a voice on this topic. He says he plans to hold a roundtable discussion for all students so they can continue to educate each other and talk about race relations. Reporting in Prairie Village, Lexi Suter, 41 Action News.